question is about the normal distribution. The height of the student in the single years group in the larger school can be modeled by the normal distribution. It is given that 40% of the students are shorter than 1.62 meters and 25% are taller than 1.79 meters. Find the mean of the standard deviation of the height of the student. Okay, we have the normal uh, of the normal distribution like ring bell, um, like this. And here is the uh, value for mu is mean mean and standard deviation we simple like this. Uh, here we need um, the 50% and here is 100% and nearly is 0% in here. We have that the give uh, the student is shorter than 1.62 because this number is less than 50% 50, 50 so I can waste that the 1.62 will be lies in here 1.62 and the area under the curve of this one is present for the percent of the students short, shorter than 1.62 so here we have is 42 uh, 40 percent and we have that the 25 percent is taller than the taller than is mean if you identify away is 1.69 and the area of left hand and right hand side of the, of the 1.79 will be 25% okay it's less than 50 so I can press that here maybe present for 1.79 and the area under the curve in this area in this section will be 25% Okay, now let's take the um, let's take the um, formula to calculate here. We have the function of the area like this, and here is we have, you have the mu will be minus uh, the value is one point sixty two will be minus mu and divide by here, and you got this one will be uh, zero point four present for forty percent. So using your calculator, you can inverse the normal distribution in your calculator. You will find that the number of the 1.62 minus v divided by um, standard deviation. Okay, wait a minute. I will use in my this one. The points uh, for this value will be equal to minus 0.25 and 3. Okay, or uh, another way if you don't know, uh, because you know that 1.62 will be less than we, because we is the right hand side of the 1.62. So this number will be equal to minus in a negative position. Uh, negative value so I can change another way this is way one you're using the formula and after that you quite easy to set the equation between the mu and standard deviation from here but the second one you can rewrite that because this one uh, if you don't know how to use in the calculator you can use in the um, the table normal distribution table and you can write out that because the number inside the bracket here is negative so I want to change it to become positive by 1 will be minus of mu minus 1.62 because when I change from the negative become the positive I have to take the minus uh, 1 take the minus the value here so here is 0.4 so you can rewrite or you can use your numerator and normal distribution table to calculate here for take the 0.6 and 0.6 will be in your calculator uh, in, in your normal table so you can rewrite and you can take the compare in your normal so you will have this number will be equal to 0.253 just like the same meaning of this one and here
So the first equation you can guess, uh, you can take here is uh, 1.62 minus formula you will have equal to minus two, uh, 0 0.25 and 3 times with the standard deviation and then I will rearrange or uh, change the position and I will have the second one 1.62 will be equal to mu minus 0 0.25 3 standard deviation okay uh, wait a minute for rewrite this one in my uh, Yes, V minus 0.253 standard deviation. Okay, it is the first equation. So the second one will be the 25. You have the 25 area will be living in this one. So here is a 0. Point here. And but the formula or the function to calculate the area under the curve like this, the value minus from V and divide by standard deviation this formula only calculates the area under the curve present for right hand side of this point right hand side I mean here but the question gives you 25% in left hand side so you can take the minus for subtraction for calculate the right hand side of the left hand side sorry so here at the right hand side 25 the total of them is 100% so the left hand side have to be equal to 75% so this formula will be equal to 75% is mean like this okay so I can guess that um, the value for value inside the bracket is could be This would be 0 0.674 here. Okay. Minus from V in D equal to 0 0.674. And up here is the second equation. The first equation you have is minus. 0 0.253 standard deviation the second one is 1.79 and equal to me sorry here is blood plus 0 point and now we have the system of equation using calculator one more time or calculator system equation Okay, wait a minute, I am doing So you will have your answer is We will be equal to 1.66 And the standard deviation Will be equal to 0 0.18 and 3 Okay, let me see this is 6 here And we take the 3 decimal number Okay, we finish this question